I decided around about six weeks ago to order the Canon EOS R6. It was an easy decision for me between the R5 and the R6 because the R6 does everything that I need at a cheaper price. It shoots 4K video at 24 and 60 frames per second. It has IBIS built in. It has access to great lenses in the RF glass. It has C-Log, or hopefully with a firmware update, even better. C-Log 3 would be nice, Canon. And it also has brilliant autofocus with a dual pixel autofocus too. Now, both the R5 and the R6 have these above features, but the R5 costs nearly £2,000 more. And yes, it does shoot 8K. It does shoot 4K at 120 frames per second. But I don't need that, and I don't particularly want it with the overheating issues. Also, let's talk about the 4K option on the R6, shall we? It's going to be down sampled from 5.5K, which means that the 4K footage is going to be even better quality. Also, let's talk about the card slot option, shall we? You've got two SD card slots which are found on the Canon EOS R6, whereas the R5, you've got one SD, and one CF Express card. Now, I don't want higher memory card bills, and CF Express cards are pretty highly priced. I prefer to spend the extra money on some more RF glass. So this is how I made my decision. But I do get why people are choosing the R5, because honestly, it's a better camera. I mean, it's a better photography camera, and it actually has more video specs. I just don't need that right now. So super happy with the decision. I placed the order for the Canon EOS R6. All that was to wait for now was release day. On the release day, I went into the retailer that I'd purchased the camera from. Now, I wanted to inquire on exactly when the delivery was going to arrive. So I spoke to one of the customer service guys on the front desk. And if you ever gone in and spoke to a sales rep or a customer service attendant before, and you get that long pause or that long silence where they just stare at their computer screen and you know that they're thinking, how am I gonna give the customer the bad news? So the guy actually turned the screen around to me to show me what was going on. And it showed that three warehouses which actually provided the delivery of the EOS R6 were all showing zero. Now, I actually had a bit of positivity here because I thought, well, perhaps zero means they'd sent all the EOS R6s out to the customers and they're on the way in the post. Unfortunately, though, zero actually means that they haven't arrived yet. Zero quantity has arrived at the warehouses. And then Zach continued to tell me that this also means that there would be at least a two to three week wait gutted so the first thing after finding this out is i went home and i wanted to find out if other retailers had some in stock would i be able to order another one so i could get it quicker first company i tried was park cameras which i know are canon partners or something like that and i spoke to a guy called ben on the phone and he said to me that they will be waiting between mid and end september for the first lot to come in so that's well, that's even a longer wait. Uh, that's not good news. So I carried on and I phoned some more companies. I phoned CVP.com, Jessup's, BH Photo, and what was the last company I phoned? Uh, I phoned Clifton Cameras as well. Each one of these companies gave me the same bad news. So unfortunately, guys, this means that if you have actually ordered from any of these companies, that potentially you will have a four to six week wait for the Canon EOS R6, which is certainly not ideal, but it's good to know this because you can either look elsewhere or at least you know how long you're waiting and you're not just kind of waiting around for something to come when it's it's not gonna come. But if you've had your delivery confirmed from any other company, then I'd like to know below. Let us know in the comments. So, you know, I'm sure the guys watching this which are actually in the same situation as me, I would like to know if there's any companies out there which have managed to get an early batch through and they're able to provide that to some people. It's probably doubtful, but it would be nice to know. And to anyone who actually hasn't ordered from these companies I mentioned in today's video, then my advice to you would be to check with the retailer, phone them up and see if you have a wait on your hands or if you're going to be getting the camera sooner than four to six weeks time. So this was just a short video today, guys, to let you know the situation with the EOS R6. 
I have got to wait for mine and I'm sure there's quite a few people waiting for theirs. It's giving you an update and like I said, I encourage you to check the retailer that you've ordered the old camera from to at least know when it's going to arrive. If you haven't already guys, and this is your first time on the channel, please make sure you join the growing community here at Ben's Guide. It would be awesome to have you. And whatever you do for the rest of the day, make sure it's a good one and I'll see you in the next video.